You loving me, I loving you. Mothers and fathers, husbands and wives, sisters and brothers, friends for life. We won't live in the past. Hi, I'm Wayne Hugh Robertson, and you're in tune to the Making It Last podcast with the Daily Communicator, Noreen Daily. This is part two. And we're keeping it real. Welcome back. We're talking with the Robertsons. And, and, and trust me, they've been together for 11 years. So they probably started dating when they were 10. But anyway, they'd, they'd have to talk to their parents about that. But seriously, we've been having a conversation, basically just keeping it real as a couple. Now, one of the things we spoke about just before the break is the whole idea that you are learning and growing together. And that's because, of course, you would have, of, you have similar goals. But they are going to be couples who will say but we can't relate, can't to, what relate to what both of you are, you are saying, saying. <laughs> yeah, yeah so yes that part now there is a common thread that it doesn't even matter because of course um Donna says a communications major i'm a, a, a food service professional and that's that's almost like worlds <laughs> apart. Right. Mm-hmm. However, the love that we share is that that doesn't nothing affects that. That is just I know who she is, and that's why it's so important not to pretend because mm. I I actually love her her so. While I support her in achieving her goals, yes, that her that's separate from her goals, goals right? I love that person. So, um, I mean, sometimes I think about her not being in the same space as me, and I get sad. But at the same time, I'm like, okay, yeah, she has to do this. Remember that, but that person that that i love and and know and trust will always be there that person who who holds my memories will always be there despite you know where she grows and where she goes i mean there there are times where we might even run a joke and we're like you know like your your, your next your your next part not gonna know about me (laughs) because like (laughs) that there's no way that Mm -hmm. this could even the, the, something that remains, it will never change. Right. It will never change. To mm-hmm. add to that, mm-hmm. I always say that you're not your work. You, you're, an, you're a lecturer, right? Outside of lecturing, outside of going to classes, you love to sing. You love to write. You love to go to the beach. So not because you teach means that your life is just about teaching. Your job is separate from who you are. True. So true. if it is that you have two separate goals, that's okay. I mean, we don't have to want the same things. Nevertheless, who you are fundamentally, as when you would have said, remains because at the very core, that is you. Mm-hmm. So again, if, if it is you are in a relationship and you find that, you don't know your partner as much as you'd want to sit and talk write out things that you believe they should know about you mm-hmm. write about write about your interests write about where you see yourself in five years separate and apart then have a meeting and say to your partner okay so this is what i want to achieve and your partner will say to you, this is what I want to achieve. And so you'd see where you need to support each other and where you differ. Mm-hmm. Because n- as much as we are one, he's Wayne Hugh and I'm Donna C. We're two different people. Here, all right, go ahead, because I have a question. I, I, go I ahead. Think, um, we, had, we have a unique um, advantage, so to speak. And I, I would also encourage persons, I mean, if you know what you want, because we we started out in in college pretty much just fresh out of high school we got the chance to know each other before all okay. the development would have taken place so i knew donna say before she would have 
garnered all her acclaim or who she is or what mm-hmm. people attribute to Donna C. So I know Donna C before all that. Uh. I, I know her before their ulterior motives. You know, one one time we were discussing it and she's like, you know, we're lucky that we actually found love in or in uh, at our time. Not to say that mm-hmm. you can't find it otherwise. Right. But right. No, when, when when it's it's in the shroud of all the the maybe fame if that's the case mm-hmm. or who you are or, or the, how much you know how much you, you have behind your name, then no you 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 have to wonder you have to wonder like do you really are you really for me or are you for, for what for, I for have what I, okay. what I can okay. give to you so we 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 know that we're for each other mm-hmm. without anything I, yeah. I mean we have we have tested and proven that we've okay. been to the top of the road been to the to the very very, very very low, very low. <laughs> <laughs> nothing changes like mm-hmm. we just nothing changes don't okay. I am sure you're enjoying this conversation as much as I have been doing so. But we're going to take a short break and get a word from our partners. We'll be right back. Making it last is all I care to do. You loving me. I loving you. Fathers and fathers, husbands and wives. That is the connection in case you're wondering. And while she doesn't see you, it made no sense. Because she was our soul as we received your food. You can't live your best life without a healthy immune system. Boost your immune system the delicious way with Zappi's organic juices and punches. Made from local produce with zero added sugar, our juices cleanse and revitalize your body as they boost your natural immunity. Try our delicious flavors. Beat it, berry bomb, get fresh, ton up, and island splash. Find us on Instagram at Zappi's Organics or call or send a WhatsApp message at 1-876-779 eight nine one zero to order today that's one eight seven six seven seven nine eight nine one zero zappy's organic juices and punches live your best life today hello my name is nikki mason and i want to share with you my journey with noreen daily in my communication coaching sessions. As I went through the sessions with Noreen, I was able to recognize my strengths in communication. Some things I didn't recognize that I would do, she was able to unearth and allow me to recognize that these are some strengths that I had. I did have some weaknesses which I was challenged to overcome through research, um, reviewing other public speakers, and being able to sit before a camera and to speak to an audience, an invisible audience, it was fun. And as a coach, she was patient and she gave good feedback. And she was able to give me the insight into communication as to how to best use my skills, my natural communication strengths to be engaging as a speaker. And I would recommend anybody who seeks to become a more competent communicator to enroll in her program, reach out to her, and I believe you're going to enjoy the journey as much as I did. Thanks. Making it last is all I care to do. You loving me. I loving you. Fathers and fathers, husbands and wives. Welcome back. We're talking with the Robertsons. We've been having a conversation, basically just keeping it real as a couple. Here, 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 one of the things that popped up in my mind while both of you were talking. Throughout all of this, what has there been anybody close to you or even whether in your circles who at some point said Y'all are too young to be so serious. Y'all are too young to to be so, you know, so so one trap minded, 
explore, explore see what else is out else there. Is there. Yes, okay. Yes. Coming to Coming MCU. To MCU. When, you, when I started when I start MCU, when you was a youth at night. So he was in so Kingston was in and I was in Manchester. And while I was, while here, I was here, a lot, a I've lot, met a I've lot of persons who say, you know, I'm doing it on. You, you, the year I thought, boy, you want this and you want that. Explore, man, you're too young. But here's the thing. It's ne- you're, you're, you can you're never be never too young, be young to know young exactly what exactly you want to achieve. Want to achieve. As, a As a matter of fact, when you are young, young and you know exactly what you want to achieve, achieve, it gives you more time, more time to work on to that. Work on that. Okay. No, no, having a having solid a family, family is something, is something that, that I hold near and dear to my heart. I don't believe in not having not togetherness, togetherness and, and seriousness, seriousness in achieving, in achieving certain things. things. Okay. Because if you're not focused, you're not focused on what you want, then how are you going to achieve it? No, no. What I didn't what I want, did to want to happen was for me was to be distracted, distracted with boys. With boys. Because, because I know I what, know I, what ultimately I ultimately want, want to achieve, achieve for, myself, for myself, myself as a career, as a career woman, woman, as a family, as a family woman, woman, as a business, as a business woman, woman, and and, and also, also as a, as a, a game, changer game changer for my country. For my because country. because Jamaica, Jamaica is home. Jamaica, home. Jamaica, Jamaica would have done, done so much for me, so and I have so much that I want to do for Jamaica that I don't have the time. To think, to about, think about, I have two, I boyfriends, have two boyfriends, or, or I, wonder I wonder what this one, what is, this doing. one is doing. No, no. Make me a wife. Make me a wife. Make me a wife. A wife is a wife. wife. That's all the way. I'm loving, I'm loving you. you. Okay. Until okay. Okay. Yella. Yella. Mm-hmm. All right. All right. And, then and then I can focus I can on other my things. career. I can, I can focus on buying the land. I can focus on making the donations that I want to make and the impact that I want to make on this world. World. Eventually, Eventually. Okay. because I because have four houses. You don't have to okay. be worrying about that, like, that, like why, why, why spend why all spend that mind space and, 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 and the juggling. And the juggling. And the juggling. You know, Sherlock, 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 Sherlock Holmes, Holmes, he didn't listen to music. music. He, didn't he didn't do certain things because he said that he's saving, that he's saving his brain space. Brain I'm that type I'm of that person. person. Certain things certain I don't, things I don't, I don't, I don't interrupt, interrupt with. I don't pay it any mind. Because I need my brain space to focus on other things. Okay, okay. You, you, we, we, we've, <laughs> we've said, or we've touched on several things that, you know, sends well lends credence to what we said about keeping it real. But if of all that you've said, there are some people still skeptical, still cynical, and saying, you know, these two young people, they've had it good. They've, you know. The, the, challenges the challenges probably haven't probably been as great, as, great as, I have, as I have, you know. But that's for another that's conversation. Not conversation. <laughs> what would be what your would advice, be advice to, to young couples, young couples people who are saying, you know, saying, you know, it's, it's a, lot a lot to try to, try to, keep, to keep a relationship keep together, whether dating or whether married? What would what you say to them to say, say, you know, if you do nothing else, nothing else this is it right here? At the end of the day, well, don't don't say how it says we're social beings. Okay. So therefore, we will crave someone else. We will crave affection. Mm -hmm. And at the end of the world, if you have nothing. But the, 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 the care, the love, the attention of someone, mm-hmm. then everything else is all worth it because the rest is just, you can just. But Fix. when somebody voluntarily gives that to you, when you know that you have somebody who will have your back and you can grow old with this person, because there, there are so many perks to it so once it is that you can establish that this is the goal in your mind Mm -hmm. because that's just the thing i think the difference the only advantage if we had any because this 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 hasn't been easy but we we do it because we know what we know that we want each other and that's the end of it like i knew that once I once I met Dancy, there was I'm like, 
no, this this woman is my wife. And I've always, I mean, wanted a wife. So when when I found a wife, then that was it. Okay. So you have to know what you want. Mm. Love it. For, for me, challenge is welcome because that's human nature. We're, we're on earth. We don't control everything. And so it's all about how you react, how you deal with it. And once you understand that your partner is an individual and you are an, you are an individual, and so you would have bring two different things to the table, then whatever it is that comes your way, you can do it together. Two brains is better than one. Communication is key. Now, if, if I'm confused, chances are you might know how to do it. And if you don't know how to do it, we put our brains together, together then get we it can done. solve it. Now, it's a matter of staying focused on the bigger picture. That's something that we chant. One team, one dream, on time, God's time. And Excellent. We, we Listen. chant that. Listen. And that is what carry carry one us dream, through. We're time. not we're not it's not that we're lucky, it's not that we've been fortunate to have it easy because, because we want this. God knows it has if not we been should easy. go down in the nitty gritty mm-hmm. of things, you'd be surprised of, of what it is we would have endured during our time together. But one thing is for sure, because we know the end goal that we're going after because we know what it will take to achieve what we want it's not we don't have to think twice about giving things our all we don't have to think twice about solving an issue because whatever it is what man has done man can do we can fix it as a team one team one dream one time god's time that's it this was make it last podcast i just had a conversation with the robertsons And the topic was keeping it real. And trust me, they did just that. If you got nothing from what was shared, make an effort to when you're in a better frame of mind to really watch this episode again because they dropped some gems. This podcast is all about helping us to have better relationships, not just with ourselves, but with other people. And they gave us just that. I'm Noreen Daly. Until next time. Do. You loving me. I loving you. Mothers and fathers, husbands and wives, sisters and brothers, friends for life. We